What's up? Wayne Baron here with DarkFlakes.net and we are inside of Adobe Edge Animate and we are also inside of an older project. Now the reason why we're inside this older project is that we got in a question from Benyaki. I think that's how you pronounce your name. Uh, his question is, which code did you use to run mouse out? Now after viewing the video, I noticed that I did not add in or did not show what I was adding into the mouse out. And so what it is, is that you see this right here. Okay, we've got a transition that goes uh, from um, our color right there. Okay, so what it is, is that we've got a in a, a begin, which is to, to stop it. And then right over here, we've got an end, which is to stop it 1000. Okay, so, and that's basically the same thing on each part. It does a stop first and then a stop on 1000 on each one of these. Now, what is uh, added into the mouse out, if you open up the actions here, <clears throat> is that we've got a mouse out, let's say uh, crash end. So crash end is on our mouse out. This is our mouse over right here. And then our mouse out is just simply this crash end. That is basically once the mouse goes out of focus, then this right here is, is uh, run. And so uh, the run is going to be the uh, stop 1000. And that's basically all that does. Um, like I said, it's been a while since I've messed around with this project and uh but yeah that right there should clear up that one and so uh if you followed uh the entire video uh for doing all of this then you should have all this information here and then that would be put inside of your mouse out and that is on each one of your text elements and so there is nothing up underneath the rectangle it's just all up underneath the uh, your text elements, so it's going to be on your mouse out. So that one right there would be the end blade right there. So I hope that clears it up for you. And uh, any more questions, please feel free to ask. All right, y'all have a good one. Bye-bye.